tonight is a very big night. I've been asked to be on a panel of successful businesswomen. I don't need you to think what Me and Ben share parental responsibility. So whilst I head into town with the girls, Winter gets the hangout of her daddy. Let me think of a really awkward question to ask. Letitia, what are the gross profit margins that you want to achieve in your first year of business? Um, I want to make a million within the next year. Don't you think that's a bit unrealistic? No, I'm Letitia Grace, baby. Anything can happen. <laughs> Do you not think it's disgusting that you're exploiting your, do your daughter to get money? No, oh, I think it's terrible. <laughs> <laughs> well, as I've grown up with nothing in my life, I am going to do anything and everything in my power to give my child the best life possible, okay? Why are you spitting so I don't much? know. <laughs> the closer we get to the venue in Camden, the more nervous I'm starting to feel. Hi, my name is Wardess Samhara. I'm 24 years old and I am the editor of Link Up TV. Hi, I'm Valma and I just became the partnerships manager at ASOS. A TV company managing director, ASOS, these girls are like proper professionals. I'm feeling a little bit out of my depth right now. I'm Patrice and I have a digital marketing agency. We work with a lot of um, retailers, e-commerce companies. My hands are sweaty, my mouth is dry. I honestly hate speaking in public. <sighs> Hi guys, I'm Tisha, uh, do TV. Um, uh, got my earrings on them. <laughs> Make some noise for <laughs> battle, please. Do you want to put your ring on, yeah? Is that right? <laughs> On the outside, I'm laughing, but inside, I'm absolutely dying. Right, so you recently launched your own brand, Baby on Trend. What made you decide to start it? Um, ugh, I can't speak. Obviously, I got a baby, and that just, I thought, what better? I thought, like, I should do a baby brand, so I can't even speak, so. Shamed, I thought I was literally Alan Sugar going up there. God, it's just so frustrating. I had so much to say, but it just, it just, it just wouldn't come out. Oh, I feel so stupid. I just want a massive cut off winter right now, but it's late. I'm just gonna order a kebab and go to bed. Hi guys. Hello. Hi. Hi. This time I'm determined to not let my nerves get the better of me. These girls are paid £25 per ticket, so I owe it to them to keep it together. I'm just gonna follow Elliot's advice and just speak from the heart. I wanna start off telling you like our journey. So I've done like various like reality TV shows, but I've like literally come from nothing. Before I went in the valleys, I had like a thousand followers on social media and earning money on social media was like never heard of. Like I didn't even know you could make money off it. After I'd done the show, I was completely skinned. Now I understand like so many brands were turning me down, like we don't wanna work with her, she's not the image we want, she's too sexy, she's too this, she's too that. And now I, I've got, I own my own brand and I get it. You don't want someone representing you that's got their bum out in every photo, or their boobs out in every photo. There needs to be like more to you than that. Um, so yeah, this is an, uh, an example of what not to do. It literally doesn't earn you money and it gets you nowhere. Do you know what I mean? It gets you likes. It gets you likes. But it gets you tension off men, but they ain't paying you bills, are they? Yeah. So. <laughs> Keeping it real and speaking from the heart actually feels so much better and I'm actually enjoying it right now. So this is me lately and these are like my highest engaged photos and um, get like a lot of likes and impressions and stuff. And impressions is like who's looking at your photos, who's liking them. So this photo had one million impressions and these are the sort of photos I try to take as much as I can on a regular basis. Like I'm always taking photos of Winter, not because she's just stunning, but just because it does well and it, it gets me more followers and it earns me more money. It's impossible to grow and build a big following if you don't have support, fact. And no one's going to support you if you're not supporting them. Wow, Erin actually sounds really professional considering she was talking about past parcels. This is actually going much better than I thought it would. Please just like keep us updated, let us know how you're doing, if your follows are going up. That was amazing and I honestly feel so happy right now.